This time, I will introduce Sunhian Gung Palace, where you can see the beauty of Hanok the best. Sunhian Gung Palace is the house where Gozhong, 1863 to 1907, the 26th king of the Joseon dynasty, lived from the time he was born before he ascended the throne at the age of 12. It was owned by Regent Hongsun Yi Har on 1820 to 1898, the father of Gozhong. Due to the obsession of his son Gozhong, he is the only person in Joseon history who did not ascend the throne, but he is sealed as Dan Wungan as the living father of the king. Hongsun Dan Wungan ruled Joseon on behalf of King Gozhong for about 10 years, centering on this place until his son became an adult. This place was called Unhyun Gung after Urhyun, the name of the hill where Sa Ungwan was located. After King Gozhong ascended the throne, this place was repaired and expanded. Looking at the size, formality, and floor plan of this place, it is closer to the inside of a palace than a nobleman's house. The space composition, solid wooden structure, and meticulous techniques of Unhyun Gung Palace show a dignity comparable to that of a palace. Unhyun Gung Palace is an important cultural property where you can learn everything about Hanok, enough to be called the perfect textbook of Korean traditional architecture. Originally, it was about the size of a palace, but after the death of Hongsun Dalungbin, and the sale of a large part of the house, after the Korean War, the scale was greatly reduced. It is also famous as a filming location for historical movies and dramas. It departs from exit for of Ornuk Station on Seoul Subway Line 3. This is Sujuk Sa where those who were in charge of guarding and managing Unhyun Gung Palace lived. After King Gozhong ascended the throne, as the size of Unhyun Gung Palace grew, the palace dispatched soldiers to guard Hongsun Dalungbin. The tall gate in the front is made high to show authority, by making it easy for nobles riding in a sedan chair to enter and exit. Noen Dang is the Sarong Chai of Unhyun Gung Palace, the main residence of Hongsun Dalungbin, and the place where he did politics. The meaning of Noen means to respect the elderly and make them comfortable. It was built in 1864 by King Gozhong, and the spatial composition, structure, and detailed techniques show a dignity comparable to that of a palace.
Dorok Peng is the Enchai of Unhian Gung Palace, the most central building of this place. In contrast to the Saren Chai, the Enchai has a kitchen, and is a space mainly used by the female owner. It is the only building in Unhian Gung Palace, to display the highest level of hierarchy, by decorating, the capitals of the pillars with Gongpo, a pointed bird-winged shape. Noruk Bang was used as their residence whenever they visited Yongkian Gung Palace, after the wedding ceremony of King Gozhong and Queen Myungsun was held here in 1866. After the wedding, it could no longer be used as the An Chai, and it was a detached palace, and was mainly used for large-scale events, such as family parties. In addition, after applying on the Yongkian Gung website, and consulting, you can have a traditional Korean wedding ceremony here in spring April to June, and fall September, to November for a fee. The western-style building at the back of the Unhian Gung Palace is Unhian Gung Yangguan, which is more famous as a goblin's house in the K-drama Guardian, The Lonely and Great God. This place was additionally built in the Western Renaissance style in 1912, inside Unhian Gung Palace, and used as a place to receive guests. It is now used as part of the Duxung Women's University building, and the inside is a restricted area for outsiders. After King Gajon's wedding, Noruk then changed its role from the Enchai of Urhian Gung to a detached palace. So, in 1869, Erodang was newly built to serve as the substantial Enchai of Urhian Gung Palace. Ero means Hunsun Dawungan and his wife, to old men. It consists of a closed square structure with no entrance to the outside of the building and has a courtyard in the center. There are four Chinese characters that mean a pond containing inkstone water, under a cloud. It was used when grinding inkstones or watering orchids, and also looked at the moon in the night sky. It is a characteristic of Urhian Gung that it connects Norak Dang to Uro Dang through a hallway building in front. And if you go through the beautiful wooden carved door under the building, you can go to the garden behind the house. If you go to the right of this garden, it leads from Iro Dang to Noan Dang.
The Exhibition Hall of Remains is an exhibition space organized to understand the value of Urkyungung and the flow of the late Joseon dynasty through the exhibition of artifacts related to Urkyungung and Hyungsun Daewangan. Currently, the artifacts displayed here are replicas, and the actual artifacts are stored and displayed at the Seoul Museum of History. Exhibition Hall is a space where various exhibitions are planned and exhibited. There is a beautiful flower wall in red-orange color with various patterns and letters that can be seen in palaces in the front. On the flower wall that King Gojong presented to his father, ten Chinese characters are written, meaning live forever like spring, enjoy longevity and wealth, be comfortable, and live with joy for 10,000 years. To get easy and useful information about South Korea, hit Korea. Please subscribe, press like and alarm, and leave comments.